Before you buy your wallpaper, plan how many rolls you will need by measuring the area you intend to wallpaper. Firstly, measure the width of the walls you are going to wallpaper. Then divide the width of a wall, for example 3.4 metres, by the width of your wallpaper, 0.52 metres UK standard. This will tell you how many drops that wall will require, in this case 6.5 or 7 to allow for cutting and waste. Now measure your ceiling height. Most modern houses are 2.4 metres, but it is worth just checking. Divide the roll length, 10.05 metres standard roll, by the height of your wall to find out how many drops each roll will give you. Therefore, 10.05 divided by 2.4 will give 4.1 drops for a paper without pattern. Or 3 drops for a pattern paper, as the pattern repetition will have to be added to each drop. This information can be found on the roll label. Do this for each wall you are decorating. Then you will know how many rolls you need. It's really important when buying your wallpaper to read the manufacturer's label as there's a lot of useful information on there, like whether you paste the wall, pattern match, etc. Not only do you need to make sure that you buy the same batch number to avoid difference in shades, but it can tell you the roll dimensions, how often the pattern is repeated, soak time, and whether you need to apply wallpaper paste to the paper or to the wall. It's a good idea to keep a roll label to refer to until you're happy you've finished.